you know, when it comes to nozzles, we all know that a hose line has to complement that nozzle when you're going to make the push. In this industry, there are many amazing manufacturers, TFT, Elkhart, Akron, uh, Key Hose, Mercedes, um, Bulldog. Um, but today, we're talking with Joey Hayes of Key Hose, where education is key. Joey, what are you seeing out there as far as uh, hose selection when a department's evaluating uh, nozzles and or evaluating hose lines? Okay, so in, in today's fire service, we see a lot of our end users are now converting things to uh, low pressure. So in, in years past, we had 100 PSI nozzles, as you guys are familiar with, and they work great with a full gamut of, of the product offerings that we have. But when a department is considering going low pressure, they have to have the right uh, amount of material in a hose line and a specific one to support that low pressure nozzle. So every Every hose that we manufacture is application specific and it's a package deal. So like you said, the nozzle and the hose have to complement each other and it's a water flow delivery system. Okay, so with that being said, you know, we've, uh, we've launched a couple of our premier lines when it comes to those that support the lower pressure. Uh, it all depends on target flow. Uh, along with a couple of other criteria, as you as you've stated before in many of your videos, it's you know your department, your first do, your equipment that you currently have. So it's important for everybody to conduct a thorough evaluation. Contact your nozzle manufacturers along with your uh, options of hose manufacturers. Get together and put together a system educationally that you will not be disappointed with. Thank you so much, Joey. You couldn't have said it any better. Absolutely. I appreciate you. Get out there, flow some water, educate yourselves, make the best decision for your department and your response district.